Hello, it's Melinda from Alexis and Melinda's Art Space. Got a little swap envelope here today. It's from Australian Art Swap Group. So if you're an Aussie and Australian love to swap, jump on the group. They have some fantastic things. Just looking for the details of this one. This was a bit of a like a treasure hunty swap. It's called a happy mail swap. You had to include, should have been organised and had this on my screen. One handmade item, an ATC ATK, which is ours trading coin tag postcard, handwritten note. I forgot the handwritten bit when I sent one out. I typed mine. <laughs> um, a tuck spot or a pocket to add to an art journal. A piece of pretty paper, scrapbook paper or gel print, book page or painting paper. Altered paper clip, chain or tassel. Piece of lace or ribbon or thread. A page hanger or wrap around that's attached to the page when you can see it from both sides. So that one stumped us a bit, but we went on Pinterest and found a few things. So with this particular swap group they basically put all your names in a list and then you send to the person below you so you don't actually swap with the same person which is kind of cool so i sent my two off to two different people i did two lots so this is the first one when i was going to wait for the two to come in but i just i can't wait so whoops i'll have to somehow cover up her address that i sort of just put on the screen when i edit this video i'm sure i can learn how to do that so just trying to open this so I can reuse the envelope and reuse the washi. It's in a beautiful handmade envelope. I will have to get some nicer envelopes to send mine out in. I just sent mine out in nice white standard envelopes. Oh, there's your address again. It's like made out of handmade paper and it's got like stars in it. I don't mind showing my address because it's a PO box and some lovely... It's not washi tape because it's like sticky but it's got... It's London like um, London sticky tape that is really cool so what did I get oh a lovely piece of paper that is cool whoops sorry not in frame that is really cool looks like scrapbook paper and oh got an envelope that's cool I haven't seen anything like that before it doesn't look handmade or maybe it is, and you're just very good at making it. This is from a lady called, S let me check, Sue. So I've got a nice, and there's her handwritten message. Oh, I got some Celebrate stickers from Christina Reed, Do It Yourself Stationery. They're cute. Oh, I got another pack of Celebrate stickers. Cool. Be celebrating all year. Oh, happy mail. Oh, I love the stickers. It's a happy mail sticker. That is so cute. So here's my handmade tag. That is really cute. It'll be nice to put into something. Here's my ribbon. Some nice silky um, pink ribbon. What is this? Oh, this must be my wraparound thing. That's got some tags on it. Oh, that looks like it's come out of a children's book. That is really cool. What's it say? The stars are always shining. Yes, they are. And some. So, this is like a pocket wrap around thing. So, the idea is to put your art um, junk journal page in here, or your art journal page, and then you can view this from both sides. I did some little torn corner things in my video, I'll be up soon. And another cutout from, looks like a children's activity book, which is really cool. That'd be great to journal on top of. And we've got our altered paper clip. Very cute. Oh, you've even sewn it on the sewing machine. That's clever. So we've got sewing here on the sewing machine. Must have sewn the paper and the fabric now. And, oh, here, this must be the pocket. Wow, you've sewn it as well. And you've put some... That's cute. Tags from a children's book again. And just a plain tag. That one's made out of quite thick paper. And just a pocket made out of book paper and her note I will read off screen so I'm not sure whether there's anything private in there so thank you very much soon not sure whether you watch my YouTube videos um, I will tack the other video for my other swapper onto the end of this so I don't put up really really short videos and I can't wait till next month it's sorry it's not in shot I have trouble getting things in shot when I um 
I zoom my camera in. That's what I'm trying to work out. But these are awesome. Thank you very much, Sue. I'll show you the next one next, and then I'll pop this up. And the link to the Facebook group will be below. Thank you. So I'm back with envelope two of my swap with Australian Art Swap Group. So this one is from Pam. I believe she was the one that organised the swaps. So I've got some beautiful metallic stenciling on the side. And these cute stamps. They'll be really cute. Next time I'll have to decorate my envelopes. I didn't get around to it this time. So what have we got? Nothing in the envelope left. Okay. Oh, this is really cutely presented. I've not even written on the back. That's clever. I should do that. So we've got some... We had to send some lace or some fibre. So I've got some orangey fibre stuff. We had to send altered paper clip. Have a sunshine day. That's really cute. Looks like you've got a gel plate. It is really cute. Then we had to send. Oh, we've got things falling out of here. I think this is the paper wrap around stick to edge of page so it shows both sides. Oh, okay. So we, that's got pans addressed on it. So this is the paper tuck around thing which is beautifully jelly printed or sprayed. So the idea is you put this on your page and you've got like a pocket here and if you only attach it two sides you've got another pocket or a tuck, tuck spot. Oops, and then you can see it on the back. So that is really cute. That is really nice paper. I like that. I like that stencil. And in that side we had some die cuts, so we've got a house. I don't actually have a house die cut. A feather, I believe my feather's smaller than that. Beautiful butterfly. These look like they're all out of gel printed papers as well. Or maybe that one's just a scrapbook paper. And a bird, cute, and a flower. That is my handmade note, so I'll read that in a minute. Ooh, this is pretty. We had to send a tag or a... ATC or something. Oh, I like that. That's pretty. I must get or make some more sprays. Then we had to send some paper. So I got some gel printed, oh, that's nice with the metallic gel printed paper scraps. And then we had to send a pocket. It's a cute way of presenting it all in the pocket. I just shoved mine in the envelope. I must get better at presenting things. So thank you very much, Pam. They are cute. I will go and photograph those and get them up on Facebook. I like this kind of swap because it's really cute and it's bits you can use. I tend to, I've done a lot of swaps in the past where, yeah, you get ATCs and iCADs and all that sort of stuff and index cards, but can't, don't tend to use them a lot. They sort of stick, sit there in my stash. But these little bits I'll incorporate into a journal when I start making them. I keep collecting for junk journals, but haven't got there yet to make my first one this year. I will hopefully get there. So thank you very much, Pam, and I will sign up to the next one because this is fun. I like this. Bye for now.